Welcome to Landria Anka on YouTube. Let's break through fears. Let's live the awesome life that's available to us at any moment. Isn't it time? Are you ready? Well, one thing that can really help you is to be grateful. Now, I always see these like Oprah and all these uh, being grateful and oh, I'm grateful and I'm grateful. I'm like, okay, you know. It just seems like you're walking through the motions. But let's really, let's really take a look at that, being grateful. What is being grateful? What it does is it creates the feeling, even if you're not feeling it, if you really make an effort to be grateful for what you have, it starts to create the feeling of having enough. So when you're manifesting, if you're feeling lack, and you're meditating on, you know, manifesting, but you're feeling lack, not happening. It's not going to happen. If you're worrying and then you're trying to manifest, you're not going to get anything except for more worry. The reason why grateful, being grateful is such an important part of just being here is the fact that when you're seeing what you have, you start to create the mindset of having abundance. And the more you practice, and that's why they say practice being grateful, because you may not always feel it, but you have to practice, just like meditation. It's not easy to meditate for most people. But the more you practice, the more you actually will be able to do it, and you'll start to see the changes. This has to be a daily thing for everyone who wants to really see the things in their lives show up that they know they, they, they can have. It does exist. Everything exists at one time, always. It's just you opening up a, a door to let it in. But if you're, you know, leaned up against that door, you know, crying the blues because you don't think you have enough, it can't be heard. You have to connect to that same energy that wants that you want, that you want to come in. So you have to already be grateful for the things you have and grateful for what's coming to you, too. I do that a lot. Thank you for my next bestseller. Thank you for my next movie. Thank you for all the people that filmed my movie. What movie? The one that's going to be on television next year after this one. The one that's going to show up next Christmas after the one I just did because I already know it's done and I'm grateful for it. Thank you. Now what should I work on next? So the gratefulness can be, you know, wow, I have this beautiful home. I am so grateful. I love my home. I'm so happy here. You know, and then you can say, okay, well, I want a bigger kitchen or I could use a couple extra bedrooms. Well, thank you the universe for that and envision it and be thankful for what you have already because if you're not liking what you have and you're envisioning grateful for what you're going to have that means you're just really not grateful for what you already have so why should you get any more you have to be grateful for everything everything even some of the lessons that we learn that are not so pretty so Gratitude is so important. It is the key to manifesting, like so many other ones. And that's the feeling again. Everything comes from within. Everything. You can think all you want. In fact, thinking is a barrier most of the time. You really don't have to do much thinking. What you need to do is to focus on all of the beautiful things that are available to you now if you choose and you're creating your reality so what can you be grateful for today even if you're in a really bad situation I know I've been there I've been in situations you're like what am I supposed to be so grateful for I'm not feeling grateful today when actually I'm thinking okay you know I'm healthy you know I, I do have a roof over my head you know I do have a car sitting out there I do have loving you know at the time loving family and uh, um, friends I say that because my parents are dead. But they're still loving me from the other side. There's, you have everything available to you. Be grateful for it and practice that daily. And you'll see some things start to change. Because you'll start to be happy. 
You know, just really pay attention to what you have. Do you have one good friend that you can trust? That's something to be grateful for. I know a lot of people that don't. Do you have family? Do you have a loving family? Do you even just have family, even if they're annoying? I don't. My brother and my parents died. So, I mean, my dog's gone. My dog died. You know, so, you know, be grateful for what you have. It's beautiful. It's wonderful because life is fleeting. You only have this one once. All right? As we know it, at least. Are you grateful? I'm grateful for you, my audience that I've touched, connected with, that maybe somehow I've changed your day or changed your way of thinking for the positive that could do something good for you. I'm grateful for that. It gives me purpose. <laughs> it gives me a chance to use all of my knowledge and experience in a very positive way. So I'm grateful for you. Thank you. Now go be grateful and look around at the beauty around you. And, and when you look in the mirror, look at the beauty in that and be grateful. Namaste.